guys hey guys you're welcome back to my channel and it's been a while since i last vlogged i've not vlogged in a while and that is because oh my god the cold is plenty the cold is a lot it is a lot whenever i try to vlog i'm always not motivated to vlog and another reason why i've not been vlogging is because i have I, like i said in my in the previous clip or previous vlog i wasn't in my place I was in my apartment when I arrived here I arrived in a friend's place for my own apartment to be ready do you understand so I stayed in my friend's place for like five days or four nights before I moved into this place so that's the reason why I haven't vlogged but now I'm in my own apartment now I can vlog as much as I want now and I don't know <laughs> I don't know so yeah I went shopping yesterday and day before yesterday i went to shop for some things i i could not vlog because it was cold it was cold the cold was too much i don't know if you guys can see the like the the cord on the floor that is for my microphone that i'm using to speak right now okay so yeah that explains what is on the floor if you guys can see it anyway so i went shopping yesterday to buy some things i have i came here with a boot but i realized that i would need another boot so i went to buy another boot this is what the boot looks like let me show it to you guys yeah so i went to buy these boots and then i also bought the very popular fleece leggings which is what i'm wearing right now i'm wearing fleece leggings right now but let me show it to you guys this is what i'm wearing i'm wearing fleece leggings underneath it but i don't like the color so i decided to put these black leggings over it i like it the way it looks like this okay so i bought fleece leggings yesterday i also bought i bought head warmers i also bought gloves i i came i came into this country with gloves with one pair of gloves thank god my mommy gave me that glove my mommy gave me those gloves at the airport and thank god my mom gave me those gloves because immediately i left manchester airport the cold that welcomed me was not from here so the first thing i did was to put on my gloves so i went to shop for more gloves yesterday i also bought some kitchen items and what else i bought some kitchen items um groceries i brought food i brought a lot of food but i didn't bring rice i didn't bring um granules or vegetable oil I didn't bring palm oil and pepper of course i would not have brought pepper so i went to shop for all of those things yesterday and i'm now in my apartment i also bought let me show you guys my duvet the duvet here is very thick yeah i also went to shop for my duvet no 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 no. If my friend bought this duvet before i came before i arrived okay so i went to shop for my duvet cover my bed spread and the pillowcase i came here i came to this country with my with a bed sheet but i don't even know why i didn't i didn't use it okay i didn't it's still in my bag my mom gave me one very fine bed sheet like that but it did not come with duvet cover so i had to go shop for duvet cover and when i was shopping for duvet cover i decided to buy a matching bed spread because the bed spread i have is not white so since the duvet cover i got was white so i decided to buy white bed spread as well yeah let me also show you guys something i came into this country with you would not believe it so i came into this country with this blanket with this fleece blanket oh my god when i when i knew that i was going to like leave nigeria and come to this country and i knew it was going to be cold i knew in my mind that i was going to come with this blanket no matter how much stuff that i bring i knew that i was going to come with this blanket this fleece blanket and it was a pair it came in, it's, it's it came as a gift from sugar bear hair so i just had to bring it this thing alone weighed like three kg three three point something kg but i started to bring it i started to bring it. i didn't bring many clothes to this country uh, uh, even the clothes that i bought to this country they are somewhat depressing <laughs> i don't bring lots of clothes to this country just very important some very special clothes to me and jeans jeans socks sweaters those are the things that i brought to this country basically and i'm st i know i'm still going to have to shop for some clothes like more sweaters because this cold even though i knew it was going to be cold in this country i not like i didn't expect it to be this cold but the cold just eat differently i'm inside the house right now and i'm wearing gloves and I'm wearing these socks. This socks is actually a very is a lifesaver. <laughs> let me let me just tell you guys something very quickly. 
let me just get something very quickly so when my sister was relocating out of nigeria when she was coming to this country she bought these gloves let me show you guys she bought these gloves uh, sorry these socks right it's very thick it's very thick okay so and i told her that the cold cannot be this much you don't need this kind of this kind of socks just drop it besides your luggage i mean you have capacity you don't need just drop this these socks and that was what i told her then and she dropped it now it was time for me to relocate well my mind was just like let me pick it let me pick these socks and drop it in my box not knowing that this socks was going to be very 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 useful this socks is very useful whenever i'm inside obviously i cannot be wearing i cannot be walking barefooted inside the house and normal socks is not thick enough so whenever i wear these socks i mean it calms the cold down and whenever my feet is covered and my hands are covered like this the cold reduces a little bit okay so these socks oh my god these socks has been a lifesaver like very very good so i think i'm going to buy more of that maybe one one more pair or two more persons i'm just going to be wearing it inside so that's basically the update i'm now in my apartment i don't know if i should do an apartment an apartment um what's it called tour i don't know i don't know is it this place is actually very nice like two bed two bath and one um one sitting area and kitchen maybe i'm going to do an apartment vlog later i don't know yet but that is the update right now okay so guys um my sister gave me a trick for to manage this code okay because it's not every time we put on the eater in the house to save energy bill okay so she told me to get hot water bottle and she told me that this hot water bottle i'm going to i'm going to like when i get it i'm going to show it to you guys uh, or put the picture on the screen hot water bottle she told me that she got it for like a pound or two in london but when i checked amazon i was seeing it for like 11 pound like why is it so expensive if i had known i would have brought this thing from nigeria because it's about three thousand four thousand naira in nigeria so why why is it that expensive but anyway while searching for hot water bottle affordable hot water bottle yesterday yesterday night i found it on b and i found it on b and him so i'm going to be and him now very soon because i found it for two pound and i want to buy like two or three so i'm going to be on him now to check for hot water but and i went there yesterday i went there yesterday i just i it just did not occur to me that i should buy hot water bottle so i'm going to be on him now to buy hot water bottle to, to um <laughs> to manage this code basically so yeah that is what i want to get up to now and when i come back i will start arranging my studio room and set up my camera and see the lighting how my how 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 i'm going to be filming in the bathroom and you know all of that all of that yeah right now the, i mean it's obviously winter the sun is not always out but my apartment has like light comes in really well like i have really big windows in both rooms but i cannot open them i cannot open the windows <laughs> i cannot open the windows i'm just waiting for summer i can't I, I really can't wait for summer i know i'm going to enjoy this apartment more in summer because i'll get to open the windows and natural light will be able to come in properly but apart from that the lighting here is actually very nice the lighting in the sitting room is nice the lighting in the room is nice as well i've actually not put on all the lights in this room and it's clear like this the lighting in my studio room is also nice so i want to like um fix because i brought two lights into this country my soft box and my led lights and the lighting in the room is okay as well so i want to set up my studio room set up my angles for my for my videos okay and do that so that's what i'm going to do when i come back from bnm but right now i want to get up go to be and him and and buy my hot water bottle because that is very important very important let me also just to get something very quickly doing skincare in this weather has been difficult i have not been motivated to do my skincare i have not been motivated to do my skincare because the weather has been very very cold but thank god i came with into this country with good products my hair bundama of course let me show it to you guys like for my esthetician you know and that was how i cleared my skin by the way if you have not i'm going to do a video i don't i've not done the video but i'm going to do it on how i cleared like the whole thing how i cleared my skin okay but the weather has been so cold so doing skincare has not been very very 
like i've not been motivated basically so i've just been trying my best to do it because i don't want my skin to go back to how it was before so that's what i'm currently doing now getting ready doing my skincare to go to b&m and also i'm also trying to wear my sunscreen because even though it's winter there is no sun but as long as it's day i have to wear my sunscreen so i want to wear my sunscreen now and another thing that I find really interesting is that when I was in Nigeria, I can have my bath one million times in a day. I can have my bath now. I have, it on, I have it on that bath in the next two hours. But here, in this cold, I only have my bath at night. Like at night, because I've not started school, I've not started going out like that. So I only have my bath at night. And even sometimes, I don't, I don't bath in a day. I wait till the following day to have my bath. I'm just telling you guys now like it's so cool and I, I know i'm going to get used to it i'm going to get used to it i'm going to get used to it but till then i'm just trying to gist you guys what has been happening and how i've been coping with this cold oh my god the cold the cold hmm it's not from here so let me just wear my boots now wear my jacket i got a jacket in nigeria it's a winter jacket and funny enough although it was expensive so why wouldn't it work <laughs> i got a jacket and it's working really well for this winter it's working really well for this winter i got another one yesterday when i went shopping so i can have to i know I'm, I'm still going to buy more but i mean that's it for now that's it for now i've really spent i've spent less than a week here so let me show you guys the jacket because that's the jacket i'm going to be wearing today she said she wanna have your baby And you don't wanna break her heart Now you wonder why she's acting crazy You knew you were wrong right from the start Since it started you can't pull yourself together You're feeling under pressure Heart won't let you let her go, no, no It's time for you to go Just think about your soul let me tell you what I know Love don't cost a thing And if it costs you something Then you better get to running uh, ay, I'm like love don't cost a thing And if it costs you something Then it won't amount to okay, nothing Okay, let's go She told me that she needs me And every time she sees me she squeezes me don't try me, what you want from me? What you want? Could it be the anointing that rests on me? Rest on me. It's gotta be order before the altar uh, And I will never dare alter uh, never. The timing and the purpose sent by the Father right. This was the jacket that I bought from Nigeria And it's really thick It's not too thick but uh, it's okay for this cold I mean it's doing what it's supposed to do After layering up inside of course <laughs> It's doing what it's supposed to do and I kind of like it. So and it's it's kind of, it's kind of fashionable. I mean I can dress it up and I can dress it down. Right now I'm not wearing too much. <laughs> I'm wearing too much. I'm wearing a lot, but I'm not I don't you get what I'm trying to say. I'm just I just want to get something down this down the streets, like around the town center. So yeah, I'm ready to go to be an name now. So hey guys, I recently just left Primark and Wilco to get the hot water bottle. I also got some hand gloves for washing dishes. Okay, and yeah, I'm going home now. I'm done. I'm done. For, I'm done for anything outside today. I'm going home now. Okay. Right. Okay, how is this supposed to work? How is this supposed to work? Because I'm not feeling Abby, is it working? I don't know. <laughs> Let me, let's see. So I'm supposed to hug it. I mean I'm not feeling any warm though. Ah I mean, I'm not let me remove this tag. I mean, I'm not feeling any, any warmth. It's just warm, it's not hot. Well, my hands were cold before, this particular one. It was cold before, but it's now warm. How does it work? 
I'm just going to, I'm just supposed to hug it like this. Till when? Uh, it's so warm. So I was also told that this hot water bottle can also help to warm up the sheets, like the duvet, the blankets and all of that. And since my blanket is always very cold, whenever I'm not inside, <laughs> whenever I'm not on the bed, my blanket, my duvet is always very cold. So I want to try it out. I'm going to drop it inside and cover it. And when I'm ready to sleep or when I'm ready to lie down, I'll come check it if it actually works. Okay. So this is my bed. This is... Make sure you walk. Walk. You this thing. You must walk because I actually looked for you. I looked for you. I looked for you. So you have to walk, okay? Okay, let's see if that's going to work. <laughs> Everywhere is cut out, but let's see if it's going to work. So guys, I just finished from the kitchen. I'm not done, but the rest is on fire. I want to let it cook, okay? So I want to enter inside my duvet now i want to enter i want to lie down press my phone while i wait for the food to get done and now it is time to check if this thing actually works so let me enter inside the duvet now <laughs> it actually works oh oof. like not all the parts of the bed is warm or just some parts just around the area where the you know where the hot water bottle is not every part of the bed is warm and i mean it's something it's it's actually something i think it's better than nothing yeah it's something so you just put it around the area where you know you usually sleep and it warms up that area i i, I like it yeah i like it oops and it's still warm like it's too oh my god it's still warm yeah so i'm going to hug this now and i'm going to feel warm and just press my phone while i wait for the food to get done i've not eaten anything today the time is currently 5 30 and i've not eaten anything i only had biscuits in the morning so i'm hungry and i'm tired so let me just go ahead now and edit some of my videos watch netflix maybe because by january this today is the last day of december December 31st by next week it's going to be really busy for me yeah so let me just rest because I really deserve it I've gone through a lot of stress in the past two two months three months you know yeah so let me rest